Okay. Thank you for the opportunity to present this to you. Uh, before I start, let me ask, does anybody don't have the apps Bible is on his or Yes. I don't have the app. No, no, uh, Bible is, Bible that is. You don't have it on your phone, could you please download it now from the app store or this store? Bible that is. What's the word right here? Oh, I just had it. Can we share our Wi Fi with you? Can we share the password with you? This is the Wi Fi password. Because for the program, we will be using this app. Everybody is going to be using this app. But there's another way not using this app. If you have the file of the, of the audio Bible, or if you up to read instead of listening. But this is a listening program, so we would like to invite the church to be uh, engaged in church listening. Although they can, anybody who would like to prefer to read, they can read. Or, uh, Personally, from my, my own experience, it's, it's even ideal if you listen and read at the same time. You can even add one more thing. You can watch the gospel movie. Read, listen, watch the movie. Is the movie linked to this program? Uh, no. Okay, so, so you have to go to YouTube and find it. And uh, yeah, it is, it is linked in, in a website, FCBT Indonesia. Oh, yeah, yeah. FCBTIndonesia.com. tutorial on the on the apps you can go to YouTube Bible is app tutorial there's a complete tutorial on this one but it's not complicated to listen on their heart language. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, and you can download the, your language into your phone. Mm -hmm. So the next time you listen, you will need the, the Wi-Fi connection. So you have the apps, right? Yes. Is it? Oh, is it? Oh, no, yeah. okay. 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 Is it a typhoon? Saya punya 
you will come to this uh, menu. You can you see there are third, third, uh, 1,322 languages uh, at the time when I when I record this. Wonderful. You can choose if you know the name of the language you can just click the language and, and search for the language. Uh, you can also choose to click the country like for example Indonesia uh, click on the country and then you choose Indonesia and then you get the list of all the languages in Indonesia there are 76 languages right now Indonesian languages and then you can search the name of the language <clears throat> this is the and then when you choose the language you come you come to this page you choose the book and the chapter you want to listen to and you push the play button you choose the bible right yeah the bible the Bible, yes. Which Bible you want to use? The Bible? Uh, you choose in the language. Oh, I already choose the English. And uh, I, yeah. Which one do you want to You have to click on the on the speaker icon. You're not. I don't think you're in. Uh, yeah, there you go. Uh, which English? There are several English versions. I just get this in ways and then there are versions of English. Yeah, this and you can get drama and yeah. not drama. Yeah, so if you like the music. Yeah, whichever version you choose, click on the sorry. Click on the icon speaker. Oh okay, icon speaker. Uh, speaker icon. That means you have the audio. Oh. If there's no uh, speaker icon that means it has only the text. It doesn't have the audio. Mm -hmm. Because some uh, text there only only have the uh, only have the text doesn't have the audio yet due to copyright issue or others. But if you click if, if there's a uh, speaker icon, you click on the icon and then you get to this page. It's, it's processing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then you can choose the whatever. Uh, book or chapter, and and play. That's very cool. That means you can read and you can listen at the same time. You can scroll up and down. The and here you see a blue uh, arrow, down arrow here at the bottom left corner. All right. This is for downloading the. Language. Offline. The version. When you click this, you have an option of downloading the chapter or the whole book or the whole New Testament into your phone. If, if you want to download the whole New Testament, you probably need some good speed. Uh, that is the speed, the space in your computer. Yeah. Uh, storage. Mm -hmm. mm, but you can. You can download by book. Why? Why do I have fewer languages than you had? Uh, how many languages? Eleven seventy-seven. Uh, maybe you're four. Oh, what? I really don't know why. It should be even more than that because this was some time ago. This is exactly like this. Now it says it's updating languages. Oh, updating, okay. Then when you, when you push the play button, then you will. Uh, 
you will listen to the audio. It's really transformation. We want to encourage the church to be uh, to be reading the Bible, listening to the Bible. I mean, if in Indonesian churches, if you ask the church how many have read the whole, not just not the whole Bible, the, the whole New Testament, for example. I mean, if, if we ask Indonesian churches in general. Mostly, most people, even in church, wouldn't have read the whole New Testament, let alone the whole Bible. So, this kind of program, hopefully, it is our, our aim to, to create a habit in a church to daily read or listen, and to be engaged uh, in the scripture. I have some data on the survey in America, not in Indonesia. 
This is some data. Average American family owns four Bibles, and yet 41% of them confess to never reading it. This is in America. In Indonesian Christian people, must be lower than this. I mean, never know. But uh, yeah, for sure we don't have the data. And then 65% of Bible readers in America have never read the complete New Testament. So that's why we would like to to encourage them to read or listen to the whole New Testament. One of the reasons is really why audio, one of the reasons people do not read. It's not that they cannot read, but people do not read. In Indonesia, uh, there's, a, there's a study by an American university in the whole world about literacy in general. Indonesia ranks second to bottom. Only higher than Botswana, a country in Africa, in, in literacy rate. Meaning Indonesian people do not read. Uh, very low literacy rate, uh, especially if you talk about people in, in rural areas. Even in the cities, people don't read. So we offer them to listen. If you don't want to read for any reason, why not listen? I mean, sometimes people, why do you not read the Bible? Why do you not read? I don't have time. The Bible is so thick. The font is so small. I just don't have time. <laughs> the pictures. <laughs> oh, they're just not readers. Yeah. Yeah. And, okay, you don't have time to read. You do have time to listen. Yes. In Jakarta, you go to the office, you spend two hours in a car. Yeah. You can listen to the Bible half an hour a day. I told people, you do jogging, you can listen to the Bible. You cook, you can listen to the Bible. You see, in a presentation, I asked the ladies, how long do you spend time doing your makeup? <laughs> Half an hour, right? Whoa! <laughs> 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 Look at my face. <laughs> 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 like, you know the zero here? <laughs> I know, I'm the, I'm the exception. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, listen to the Bible while you're doing your makeup. And, your face will shine brightly yes. <laughs> after you do your makeup while well, listening to the Bible. I mean, you can do multitask when you listen mm -hmm. in the car and everywhere while doing other things. So it's it's much easier to listen than to to read. And this is the further study, the conclusion of the study that. Church standard is not a predictor of transformation. Mm. It is the scripture engagement. Yes. Sure you know about this. I mean, it's the biggest factor in transformation. I mean, we know that the uh, word of God is power. <clears throat> Number one thing people want the church to help them with is how to engage with the Bible. So, we try to help them to engage with the Bible, whether listen or reading. And what helps people form a habit? If there's no tool, you cannot help somebody to form a habit if there's no tool. So, this audio is a tool to form uh, people's habit, to listen. With a tool, it increases the chance by 5% with an effective tool. So our audio is a, is a tool, and hopefully it's effective. The, the Bible is a tool, of course. I mean, you read it. And the chance increase more when people doing it in community, not alone. It's the same when you want to quit smoking or drinking. Mm -hmm. You join uh, what uh, triple A group or yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. that kind of community. So the chance of being successful to <coughs> form a habit of not drinking or not smoking in a group is 
greatly increase. Same thing with reading or listening to the Bible. You do it in a group, the chance of success that you do it diligently is increased. So this is what we are trying to, to provide to the, to, the, to the church. It says it takes 21 to 90 days to form a habit. Hopefully 40 days also uh, enough. But it, when, when, when people are used or even the first time listening or reading the Bible in 40 days, it will create the hunger and thirst in them to know more, to listen more, to read more, or to ask questions to knowledgeable people. I mean, they are, they are stirred to, to wanting to dig the Bible more when they, are, when they have already started. If, if they don't start at all, how can they suddenly want to uh, engage in Scripture? So, uh, how do we do this? I mean, how do we do this 40-day gospel listening? We will form groups of maximum 10 or 12 people, a group of people. Uh, so we form a group of 10 or 12 maximum, and then we ask them, of course, to download this Bible is, or any other uh, audio Bible, or if they want to read, they can just read their Bible. But we will form a WhatsApp group for each of the group form, 10%. Uh, form a WhatsApp group. For, uh, and then invite all the members to the WhatsApp group. And the, the WhatsApp group is used only for this program. I mean, you don't send good morning to you and blah, blah, blah. Oh, I have power updates today. I mean, yes. this group is only... Please, have something for sale. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I have my kitchen for sale, stuff like this. Uh, so that's why there should be... There should be a facilitator observer in, uh, in each group and when we offer this program to the church each of us will become facilitator of the group uh, facilitator means you observe how, how people mm -hmm. use the group or if, we, if they don't share uh, and then you <coughs> gently remind them that they haven't shared today and then every member engages with each other daily by sharing his or her personal reflection in the WhatsApp group. Uh, this is what they share. Personal reflection on one or more highlighted verses from the assigned chapter or chapters. Or from the whole as a chapter. From the chapter as a whole. So he, each member shared to the WhatsApp group how God speaks to him or her through the reading or listening, through the chapters assigned. Each, each day of the 40 day, we will be assigned a, a, a schedule uh, for reading. I can actually. Uh, To the give it down. So you you share the rima how God speaks to you. If if you listen to one or two chapters and you think the chapters don't speak to you at all, God don't speak, just share. I don't get anything today. <laughs> but if you pray before reading or listening and and listen or read the, the word of God, I don't think God will be silent to you. 
so that's that's actually the, the schedule of each uh, day. It's really uh, and then you share what how God speaks to you through through one or two chapters or the whole uh, one or two verses or or the whole chapter, and then you share what is your personal commitment or application from what you listen or what you read. How do you want to apply what God says to you through the listening or through the reading? And in this sharing, it is important that we do not teach, we do not preach, and we do not mentor to each other. No preaching, no teaching, no mentoring. Meaning when you share, your language should be an I language. Not we, not you. You don't say, you have to do this, especially you have to do this. No. You say, what do you want to do? What I want to do? So, nobody will get offended when you don't teach and you don't preach. Uh, you share what you have, what you get from the Bible. And we learn from each other how other people are uh, learn from the Word of God. And again, the facilitator, the observer, will gently remind people who are saying, Oh, you have to repent, <laughs> this, this and that. And there's no you. You have to say, What do I, what do I want to do after listening to the Word of God? So, Uh, usually when I go to villages and form Bible listening group, not WhatsApp group, Bible listening group, weekly meet and listen to the word and discuss, I would give suggestion, please in the group, there's no pastor, please. Because the tendency, if there's a pastor in the group, number one, people would be silent, all oh, the pastor and the wife would be let him just teach us, preach to us. Mm. On the other hand, the pastor tend to want to teach to the group, right? No. So, <laughs> uh, really? Or, well, well <laughs> I, speak, I explain yeah, further to the pastors, if you are in the group, please let all people uh, uh, participate uh, and then do not right away teach what they listen. I mean, uh, yeah, that's it. So the same thing in WhatsApp group. I mean, pastors, of course, allowed to be in the group. And ideally, the group is to meet weekly or two weekly <coughs> to share to one another, experience, probably testify uh, what they can within a week or two weeks. Or at least, if we have four Gospels, if you listen to four Gospels, after every book, probably meet, physically meet and share with one another. Highlight, uh, testimony, how God speaks to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If you have an emergency, we do have a Zoom link from Vic where everybody can meet face-to-face -face online. Mm -hmm. if, if there's something that happens that you cannot meet, then as long as you're not interfering, that group is not being used by somebody else in our groups. Um, yeah. So the max is 12 people, right? Yeah, yeah more or less. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> so, because he used 10, but I saw 12. Oh, yeah, yeah. He used I mean, to have it. doesn't. Better, yeah. smaller. Yeah. Uh, yeah, even six, seven is okay. As long as it's in a group. Of course, we are going to offer this to the church, to the congregation. But before we can do that, we ourselves have to do it first. I mean, the leaders. Um, because they may ask if, they invite, if we invite them to do this. Have you done it? No, I haven't done it. Mm -hmm. So 
Why are you asking me to do it if you haven't done it yourself? I mean, if we, we do it first, 40 days thing among us, we are leaders, LP, ministry team members. Uh, and then after 40 days, we can evaluate how we can improve this, mm -hmm. how we can modify this to the church, how to make it easy for the church. Because we already do it, we already experience it. If now we offer it to the church, we don't even know how, uh, if there are struggles in the group. And again, we, we want to have at least one facilitator in each group in the congregation. So each of us is going to be facilitator. We will remind people who have not shared for a day or two, hey, uh, what's happening in heaven? Well, if, if you haven't shared a day or two, stick with the schedule. If you want to skip, you skip. I mean, the, the thing that you didn't share the day before. Stick with the, with the schedule. So we will all share the same, from the same reading or listening every day. If you want to catch up, fine. I mean, you share three, uh, for three days, reading or listening. <coughs> But it is it, it will be better if we all sharing from the same passage every day. Mm -hmm. So when we read others sharing, it's we know what what, what they read, what they listen to. Uh, at the end of the forty day, and then we will celebrate together. I don't know how we can. Which is, yeah. Barbecue. Yeah. 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 Fireworks. Testimony. Fireworks. I mean, especially in the church. I mean, the whole church listened to read the Bible together, the gospel. At the end of it, of course, we as church uh, celebrate. Not, not, not only celebrate, each member of the group mm -hmm. can then bring this program to his or her own group elsewhere. Uh, whatever group. You can form a group, friends, or whatever group, and run the program in your own group. Make another group um, from the experience. This is just the name of the ministry is from Romans 10 verse 17. Faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. That's basically the program. Uh, if you have questions or, or comments or how can we do this better, suggestion, mm, please. This is this is very basic. But before before we start with the church, I will give a uh, instruction, written instruction on how to download the Bible that you said. And it's a bit of tutorial. Can you um, work with our digital media team so that they make sure that they have it for the, the week that we want it? Mm -hmm. yeah. Let's put the link in uh, e-news so that it's clickable because you can click on yeah. that to the app store in uh, Android as well as in iOS. Mm -hmm. And then it should appear in print in the, uh, in the bulletin. Yes. That's better than something on the screen. Uh, yeah. Also, uh, I will share the schedule in the in the group. So we have the schedule in the WhatsApp group. Mm. There is there is a website called in fcbhindonesia.com. This is very new, it's not, and I'm, I wasn't the one who made this. There is a, some resources. If you want to listen and read and watch the gospel film, it's there in, in the website. Is that a public website or is that something that they have to be at big to? No. Uh, no, this is uh, 
Yeah, I mean, in, in doing this program, you can go into this website and read through the website, read the, the passage, uh, because there's day one, day two. Uh, let me show you. This is 40 day listening program, a gospel. If you click day one, then there will be uh, the text is there, the audio is there, and the gospel movie, gospel film, for that passage. So, you can read, this is according to the schedule, day one, Matthew 1 and 2. Matthew 1 and 2 will appear here. You can play the, you can play the movie, the gospel film. Supposedly this can be made bigger, I don't know how. You will click on the white. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah, but then you cannot read the text. Okay, you want to you want Yeah, or if you want to follow with your Bible, it's fine. Uh, Are you? Yeah. Are you no, 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 no. Do you have four gospel films? For each of the gospel, we have a film. It was Tamar, Perez, the father of Hezron. Hezron, the father of Ram. Ram, the father of Aminadab. Aminadab, the father of Nashon. Nashon, the father of Salmon. Salmon, the father of Boaz, whose mother was Rahab. So, in each of the gospel film, the audio is the complete text of the gospel with visualization. So it's 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 really the Bible text. Uh, I think it's an IV probably. And when we form a groups in, in a church, if some people want to form an Indonesian group, meaning they share in WhatsApp group in Bahasa Indonesia, mm -hmm. it's fine. Or in Filipino, Tagalog in in whatever language. Well, of course, you can listen to any language you like. Mm. But when you share, we have to agree with the group. Uh -huh. What is the language in the group? Right? You can listen to Portuguese and share in English. Right? Mm. But we will encourage people to listen in their heart language. When there is Sula language, Java language. Awesome. And then, uh, probably some Indonesian would want to form an English group. I mean, they can share better in, in Bahasa Indonesia than in English. We can, we can offer that in church. But here in our group, uh, of course, we will be using English. And for, for our group, we will start on this coming Monday, mm -hmm. August uh, 12. 12. Yeah, I printed the date on the, on the, oh, yeah, this is great. the sheet, on the white sheet of paper. Yeah, uh, so that we know every on, on the day what we read. We will also do that with the with the church. Colorado is a language. India, Native American uh, First Nations. This is yeah. our plan. The green is our group. From the uh, yellow of the church. We want to finish this before the week of Advent, uh, before December. That's good. So, a week or two. I have that yeah, from they, the, that's the one that we got from the LT this one? Yeah, we are one, one week off from the green. Yeah. Yeah, it's the same. How many of us, actually, yeah, all of us, I mean, in the ministry and the worship team? Mm. Yeah. Uh, four, four on the leadership team plus the ones who are here, and we have seven. I think three, Dr. Hannah, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I think we have seven or eight. Seven or eight. 
Nicole, Sonny, eight. JD, eight. the two, Dr. Hannah, yeah. So we have eight plus the four from the leadership team, so that's perfect. So that's only one group that's for us. Group. Yeah. You don't need to split into two groups. Uh, yes. Maybe this question is for later when the church starting this. Because in terms of accountability, so we, although we are helping them to open the group, we will not know if they do it or not. Because you cannot ask, did you do it? You cannot use the you, remember? So no. I can no. maybe post every day, I read this, this, and this, and this. And, but if people don't respond, or don't, there's nothing from them. You cannot say yeah, you anything. Privately. No, no, the moderator can privately find the members who aren't and just say, are you all right? And then she posts it for a couple of days. But not in the group. Yeah. Your, okay. your observations are eye language. Yes. Other communications can be you. There is no other communication because in the WhatsApp. Not in the WhatsApp group, but, but I don't mean. Yeah, offline or, or to private. Yeah, okay, so. Yeah, that's why it's so hard to study to be an observer or a um, facilitator in a group and we form that group in the church. Are you able to facilitate this first one? Or do um, you prefer that somebody else does it? Doesn't matter. If you're available, yeah. just do it. I'm, I'm, I'm not yeah, going to do sure. it. I mean, mm -hmm. if, if you're willing to do it, do it for us. You sure. show us how. And, mm -hmm. yeah, keep us on track. Yeah. We have the top professionals. When you have that, then you don't go to your amateurs. <laughs> <laughs> but that uh, fine. I've done these two cycles already. Uh, and right now in Indonesia, there are probably in a full gospel business uh, fellowship, and they are doing it for the whole member in Indonesia starting in this month. That means 4,000 people. Wow. Uh, wow. Or 6,000. And there are several churches in Jakarta that already done this. They're in Bogor, in Sentura. We can. After we do this, after the church do this, we can spread this. Mm -hmm. Who knows, one day we can invite the whole city, I mean, all churches together, do it at the same time. Uh, I mean, that's, that's a possibility. I mean, it used to be done in Hong Kong or somewhere. Uh, so many churches participate at the same time doing 40 days this week. Very cool. And where do you get the video version? Uh, it's the one with drama. Yes. Uh, if it says well, one of the drama, the Bible, it's, it's, uh, no, not there. It's, it's the web. It's, it's the web. The oh, it's the website. Yeah. Oh. It's the website. FCBH Indonesia. The with drama is um, music. music. Oh, behind. Okay. Yeah. But if you want to copy the movie, film from me. Right? No, no, just show me. No I've seen it in uh -huh. That's the website. Okay. Good. What is the website? I've seen it in One word. Okay. I've seen it is for faith and Okay. For instance, I downloaded the NIV mm -hmm. with drama. Mm -hmm. On the far edge here is a film strip. Mm -hmm. When I tap on the film strip, it pulls up a video. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, so, so it's a Jesus film. Right. It's different than this gospel. Oh, so it's different from this film. So this is the Jesus film embedded. Yeah, okay. embedded there. Right. Jesus film is not a uh, Bible text. I mean, okay, so it isn't reading the whole thing. Yeah, etc. Okay. Okay. Got it. Okay. It's, it's a Jesus story, right? Okay. That's what we did for Lent. Okay. Yeah, I did that for And... Uh, when we do this with the church, if possible, if you can align the sermons with the reading of the week. We'll um, try. Um, we already have the topics mm -hmm. through, and so it might be off a little bit because the Gospels, uh, you know, it shouldn't be that bad because uh, the Gospels, you have the same story sometimes three or four times, mm -hmm. so you can't catch it on one, you may be able to right. align it with some other. Yeah. So, Whatever you can, I mean, if possible, if possible. Okay. We'll do our best, definitely. And then we will have to promote this 
three, four weeks before we started the tours. Okay, the date for that will be, we're starting on the 6th, The date for the church is, yeah, 6th of October. So how about um, on the 15th, that we have a full four weeks of that on the 15th, Sunny, can you write down? September. September 15th. Do you have a promotional video for it? Or do we, uh, does our design team need to create it? I will, I will look for it. Okay. Yeah, and, and especially if it's a minute or less, mm -hmm. just just to say, coming on October the 6th. Yeah. Da, 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 da. We'll run it for three weeks, 15th, 22nd, and the 29th. Mm -hmm. And then on the 6th, we'll close. Okay? Yeah, because there should be a, a bit of explanation. Well, are you going to, on the 6th, explain it? Because we're going to start on the 7th. On the 6th. Right. Uh, probably way before that. Oh, like in anticipation yeah. we'll talk about mm -hmm. it? So uh, that, for example, sure. people who have not downloaded the Bible is at they have time like right. a week or two. Oh well, so so your that isn't on your video? Uh no, the like what? like do you have a promotional video where it says this week download the app? Oh. We're going to be doing this. Here's a demonstration. Matthew 4. Show the video. Show online. This is what we're going to be doing. Get ready. We're launching yeah, we'll try October to the 7th. If we don't have one like that, our digital media team is awesome. Okay. Okay? Yeah. But if we could show that and then have, have like a little bit maybe where you get up on the 6th and say, don't forget, tomorrow is our big day we're launching because the 6th is also Family Sunday. So we have the children in the service, we have the parents, we have communion, it's a big Sunday. So, you know, if, if you have like five minutes where you can say yeah. very clearly, this is why, like even those points without explaining them, you know, just say, this is why. And if you want to read these points again, this is where I'm going to post them. You can post them on, yeah. on our big media or something as well. Yeah, mm -hmm. just when you come to the point to the to close of the church, based on your experience, how did the church build the groups? They they gonna do it their own, or how do you know if somebody is out? Yeah, that's why uh, we have so have facilitators. Or? We have to do it uh, one week in advance so that we have time to form the groups in the church. We'll provide forms. Forms. People uh, sign up. Their forms. For group. Make their group. Probably there's one group, a Indonesian group, you sign up if yeah. they want to have a Filipino group. How oh, many okay. people buy? It will be smaller groups so at the 10 to 12. 10 to 12. Yeah, is the thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So for we, example, we encourage everybody to sign up. Mm -hmm. okay. That's why it has to be uh, like a week before okay, we launch. Okay, so we're starting on the 7th and we want to have that launch on the 29th. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Alright, form the groups. That would be okay. So, so by, the, by the following Sunday, everybody already have, I have a group. And have the Bible ready as well. And we have the apps. But we're and not going to assume that. We'll, we'll do the groups on the 29th, and then we'll call. If you're not in a group, this is your chance to start. We should maybe do that the, the 6th and the 13th. Hey, we've launched. We have our groups. If you're not part of a group, here's your sign up. And then the next Sunday, the 13th, we've had one week of this. Do we have a testimony or somebody who can say something of what it's meant in the first week? And then in the 13th, we can announce that, just a testimony, and after that, we can let them run. Maybe have a testimony every second week or something. Yeah, yeah every Sunday, you can ask for a testimony. Yeah. Okay. And the, for example, I'll give an example. For, for example, the worship team. Mm -hmm. So yeah. I, could, I could explain to them how the program works. And then, for example, Myla, who is a leader, have, if she wants to have the, all the Filipinos from the worship because they're here. So all the Filipinos in a group, and then I can, I can, I could facilitate the other one. Or maybe we could have two different people, or Bella or Martin or something, another person to facilitate. But can I still be in the group? Yes, okay. you can be in two groups if you want. Yeah, because I'm actually, I was thinking about the ladies. To facilitate the, the ladies' dinner, so then I would just kind of um, help 
not, but not be the facilitator, but just, just to be there, just to yeah. see how it's right. like, like quietly. But each group has to be uh, informed who is going to be the facilitator, yes. right? So yes. we can mm -hmm. monitor somehow. If they have questions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You can facilitate the groups. Okay. I mean, have you thought about the logistics of how people are going to um, sign up? Do you want sheets? Yes. Where the, the facilitator would already be at the top and there would only be eight slots? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. I think, I think it would be better. It, yeah. So we'll know, you know, yeah. the groups. So we we'll know who the groups are, how many groups, who are the groups. Um, who are the it can be designated like women or Indonesian. Yeah, if there's, if there's a special designation to the group that people can sign up for that. When the group is full, they have to sign up for another group. Even when it's Bahasa, English, Adana. Yeah. 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 We would know also who are not in the group. Yeah. Right? If we have the list. Yeah. We can probably personally invite people who are who don't belong to any group yet. Um, we'd like, as much as possible, we'd like everybody to mm. participate. And you can... At least, uh, like when you, whenever it would be introduced, have everyone pull up their phone and say, "Pull up in your app store mm -hmm. to do it during the service." Yeah. 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 And just wave your phone if you've got it. Let's look for the red and the white. Yeah, something like yeah. that. Something. Just to yeah. at least initiate it. That would be nice. Up because the better it be That's what I mean. Exactly. Up the better the written instruction also on the Bible list. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And, and I forgot to mention one thing. We encourage people to journal their reflection. Mm. Actually, after you write your journal, and then you copy paste it to WhatsApp group, right? Uh, it's not the other way around. So you. If you journal it by on a computer. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it but, would be cool if the Bible is app even had a space for journaling. Uh, it, it oh, does. Yeah, it, that's do. a good suggestion. it does. I haven't. Can you find it? I'm going to look. I've never used yes, it. Yes, there's a notebook. Yeah. Okay, okay notebook. Mm -hmm. Bookmarks, highlights, and notes. Mm, we'll communicate in that. What's that group? Yeah. So you're gonna do a, a WhatsApp group for us? So yes, we, we will see. all be. Maybe Sunny can help. Be able to phone numbers. Yeah. yeah. So right, Sunny. But I do have the phone. But Sunny, tell me can you group the admin yet? We can do that. We will start on okay. Monday. Okay. They'll be in the group. So, to make notes, when you're in the Bible reading thing, if you uh, press and hold on a verse, ah. it pops up a little screen like this, cool. and then the second from the right uh, looks like a piece of paper, you tap on that, and it'll give you the text of the verse, and then you can type your note. Awesome. Cool. Okay? So that's the notebook feature. You can change the, the font, the size, the background, and everything. Uh, I haven't explored all of the, the features yeah. in the. Well, I'll tell you if we give it. If you don't have it, don't have a quick tutorial. Uh, the digital media team. If we ask them to to um, explore the app mm -hmm. and choose like four features that everybody has to have, like the notes, okay. the where to find the video, where to get in your group, and that they can certainly make a video because we have what four weeks. Five weeks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Uh, so they have time. If we tell them what day we're launching, so if, if that video is going to be for the fifteenth, then we have four more weeks. Yes. Absolutely. It seems like they're going to have a Bible study every day. It's good, eh? After we finish, some people might want to continue. Yeah. You know, they have. The, Hopefully. Yeah. I mean, with the Acts, with the Pauline right. Epistles, with the rest of the New Testament, probably, we can facilitate that. Now, we can take maybe December off 
Mm -hmm. And then see who's interested in January in kickstarting either from the beginning and doing the whole thing in 100 days, yeah. or because that'll take us through Easter. 100 days will take us through Easter, right? We'll be doing that. Mm -hmm. Especially if we start the third week of January when everyone comes back. Yeah. Yeah. So in that fact, even, even the whole New Testament, right? Yeah, the whole New Testament yeah. through Lent, through yeah, Easter, yeah. because Easter's the, I think in April, early April this year. Mm -hmm. so, great. Oh, that's exciting. So, I'm thinking, uh, um, Joshua just suggested here, maybe even with the girls, like, and the kiddos there, like, that you mentioned, even Kaya's and mm -hmm. Kirsten. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I have a team group. Kathy, Kathy would love it. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah. So let's see if Sarah would be willing to facilitate that. Do you think she would? Or is she too busy? It's like, does she like kids? Yeah, yeah. She's amazing. Yeah, I've, not, I've never noticed the interaction. Maybe Abby would do it. I wonder if Abby would do it. We have a, um, the pastor's daughter from uh, Jakarta. Mm. Um, who is who's worked with kids and whatever? Let, let me ask what she's doing. Mm. Great. Okay. If if she is interested, let's maybe add her to this group, even if we go a bit over twelve. Yeah, yeah. For a training group where you're dealing with uh, people who are already reading the Bible and so on, it's a bit less critical. Mm -hmm. I think. Right. Right. Exactly. Even if people want to join in the middle, it's okay. Yeah, um, yeah. After a game. So the LT um, whites can join us? Or I don't know. Um, if it gets too big, we'll split. We'll start yeah. together. We'll see if the tech team wants to join. Mm -hmm. if, you're, if, if Benny wants to join. Mm -hmm. you know. Not Benny. PT. PT. Every time I look at you, I say thank you, and I know it's not Benny. When it comes out of my mouth, I know it's Benny. It's okay, it's Benny. So bad. Yeah, that's right. But anyway, um, yeah, if they want to do it with us, then that's fine. And if it gets too big, it's like if we go past 14, let's do it this way. Yeah. Okay? Okay. Anything else we need on the video? Which uh, video? <laughs> I'm shooting a video for those from the LT and oh. so on who can't be here. Okay. So we'll just post this as a quick temporary video on YouTube with a private link. Okay. And they'll be able to watch it in the next week and then we'll drop it. But okay, so here's the schedule. Alright, here's the schedule. We are starting on August the, the 12th with our own group. And we will go through the 21st of September. We will start with a promo video on the 15th, which will run the 15th, the 22nd, and the 29th. On the 29th, we will launch the groups. And on the 6th, we'll have a special training because the actual reading starts on the 7th, October 7th. So the dates to know for our group, we launch August 12th for the church group, the 15th, 22nd, 29th is a media blitz. The 29th is forming groups at BIC. The 7th is the actual launch of the groups. And we'll be done about 15th or 17th. Okay. Come on, LT. We can't wait. <laughs> okay.